Hi, this video is to show you how to get that dark thing for Inkscape version 0.48. Let's get started. Going back to the original thing that comes along with the download of Inkscape 0.48, I've created a extraction tool that will extract the proper files to the proper folders to convert the original vanilla looking thing to the dark thing that some of our Inkscape lovers love and missed. In the extraction file which I have included a link for in the video information area I included a zip file that will allow you to uh, drag and drop the files that's included such as the ex executable file and the readme dark thing uh, file just in case you uh, need to look at the instructions to drag and drop them into the desired location as you wish and once you get, have that uh, on your desktop or wherever you would double click on the executable file. This would then give you this uh, executable dialog that would allow you to extract the proper files into the proper folders. And if, as you note, I also have backup files of the original, which you see here underscore BAK for backup. Also included with this I've made files for icons if you w wish to change these icons to uh, tango black and white or color. I will show you that in a moment. The first thing you want to do is make sure th that after opening the, the extraction to you at the C prompt And once you're at the C prompt, then you're able to click overwrite and then extract. All files have been extracted. Click OK. And then after that goes out of the way, you can go ahead and restart uh, your Inkscape. After restarting Inkscape, and there you go dark thing for Inkscape version 0.48 and just to show you I've also the files I also included which were the icons let me show you the directory to go to first you want to go to my computer and program files under program files look for the Inkscape share and then you would see a icons folder and under the icons folder there is icons.svg which are the original icons that comes with the Inkscape version 0.48 download. I've also included the Tango black and white and the Tango color .svg file just in case you want to uh, use one of these. All you have to do is rename this file to the icons.svg file. You may also back up the original file as you wish or we'll rename it to whatever you desire to rename it. Let me show you just what this looks like because you can actually click on these files and bring them up into Inkscape and change the icons if you like. But let me show you what one of these files actually look like inside of Inkscape. This is the Tango uh, color version. 
as you note the icons are in color they look a little different than what we see here But there you have it. That's how you actually get uh, the dark theme back for Inkscape version 0.48. If you have any comments or questions, just feel free to contact us at the email address that is provided for you in the information uh, area of this video. Thank you very much.